about that if that happens as the last couple come forward and they're off away they go lord glitters is just restrained leaving the stores out well circus maximus on the far side leads early down the center roseman in the yellow jacket the revenant is tracking circus maximus far side century dream on the near side from nazif and dark vision malatham in the black cap they're followed further back by voracious with palace pier some way back in the early stages towards the far side along with escobar sabuskas on the near side lord glitters and royal doornock also towards the rear of the field. The pace not looking that strong. They're well grouped together. And it's Roseman from Circus Maximus, followed in third by Century Dream. The Revenant, last year's runner-up in fourth, followed on the near side by Nazif. And then Dark Vision and Malatham. Palace Pier shadowing Malatham. Then Sabaskas on the near side. And they're followed by Voracious, Lord Glitters, Escobar, and Royal Dornock at the tail of the field. On their way now, passing the halfway stage in the Queen Elizabeth II stakes. And Roseman continues to lead the way from Century Dream and Circus Maximus. Nazif is fourth, the Revenant. Palace Pier, the favourite, now moving up towards the far side into about sixth place in the Silver Silks on the left. Followed them by Voracious and Escobar and Malatham. And on the right is still Nazif, followed them by Dark Vision and Lancaster House, Lord Glitters and Sabuska. Palace Pier now being asked to go on with the Revenant trying to go with him. Roseman down on the centre field, still battling away. Palace Pier's going to have to dig in and get dirty here because the Revenant and Roseman are not stopping and the favourite's feet now inside the final 100 yards is the Revenant and Roseman. Sabuska running on down the stands rail. The Revenant from Roseman. The Revenant from Roseman. The Revenant has gone one better from last year. The Revenant wins.